Well, power companies are using new technology to help spot wildfires. Portland General Electric just announced it'll add six new fire detection cameras east of the Cascades. Daisy Caballero joins us in the newsroom tonight. So Daisy, artificial intelligence actually plays a role in this. Yeah, Brittany, technology has come a long way. These cameras use artificial intelligence to detect the exact location of a wildfire, and it also knows the difference between steam, fog, and smoke, and it's already assisting local firefighters right here in the greater Portland metro area. I really do truly believe that it's a game changer for the fire service. For the last two years, Portland General Electric has partnered with Pano AI, a company that creates mountaintop cameras that use artificial intelligence to detect active smoke and wildfires in a minimum 10 mile radius. We take ultra high definition security cameras and we rotate them 360 degrees every minute. And then we transmit the data to the cloud using modern communication technology like 5G cellular technology. PGE currently has 27 of these cameras, typically atop of communication towers throughout the greater Portland area, and we'll add six more to the mix for starting at the Timberline Lodge on Mount Hood. It's brought together the fire agencies, the utilities, and the private space together in a way to try to tackle this issue as a, as a, as a wee problem. The overall goal here is to give PGE and fire districts a better way to minimize fire threats and track down a blaze. As the AI camera pinpoints the exact fire location and sends a notification to your cell phone or email. Something the Clackamas Fire District is beyond thankful for. We're getting early detection. We only run off of time and if we can, if we can uh, lessen the time to get to that scene, it's going to be a good outcome. Each location has two cameras that have a 160 degree view, but they work together to create a panoramic perspective, giving fire districts and PGE a better insight of what's actively going on. As crews are able to be dispatched in real time, I think that this we'll see over and over again is going to be saving homes and lives. And Oregon is one of six states in the U.S. already using this AI camera technology alongside two Australian states, New South Wales and Queensland. Brittany? Daisy, thanks so much.